Hi, I'm Christine. I'm at the St Emma B&B in Rothsey on the Isle of Bute. 13 years ago, my husband and I uh, decided to move to the Isle of Bute. We um, both worked on the mainland in Scotland and our children were small at the time. And we decided to come and visit Rothsey as a possible place to stay. I had plans to do something different, something that I could do where I could work from home and look after young children. We really liked the Isle of Bute and Rothsey and we, we felt we could see ourselves living here. St Ebba is an old listed building and over the years we've done a lot of work to it. We started off doing bed and breakfast but you know just doing a few rooms and then over the years we've gradually built up the business so that we're you know we're busy. In the St Ebba we have a probably quite a comfortable style, quite a relaxed, friendly I would say. We have eight rooms all together. We have a selection of double, larger double rooms with sea views and we have a, we have single rooms. We also have some family rooms. As you come in the, the entrance hall, we have the guest lounge. Um, so there's, it's quite a large sitting area. Uh, you can relax in here, you can play games, you can play cards. The Isle of Butte has certainly got quite a lot to offer. We have lots of uh, places to walk. There is beautiful scenery. Um, lots of people come here also for the wildlife porpoises, sea otters, uh, lots of seabirds that you see, you know, in the water here. People come for a lot of the history. There's um, a wealth of historical, religious history as well as Scottish, you know, kings and queens history. We do have fabulous views um, where we are in St Eba. There's, we're looking out onto Rothsey Bay. It's quite a sheltered bay, really. It's an Ebba, the breakfast we have are made by myself. So we very much try to have local produce. We use the local butchers and local fish smokehouse. And we also have a, you know, fruit and veg and things that are grown on the island. And some homemade pancakes, of course, yes, which are, are very popular. Everything's quite popular, you know. That. Choosing a B&B over maybe a larger hotel, there's certainly a lot more personal experience. I certainly want people to have a kind of relaxed experience. I want them to feel comfortable. I suppose that's, that's kind of home from home, really. You know, the island uh, has lots to offer and you want people to feel that they can appreciate that when they're here. We've certainly enjoyed building this business up and I wouldn't change anything. You know, this is where I think I was meant to be. This is what suits me and I enjoy doing this. Being B&B owner is, is what I was meant to do.